Police in Quezon City are insisting there is no cover-up in the death of Genesis Tisoy Argoncillo, the man who was arrested for being shirtless in the streets. Police have named suspects in Argoncillo's killing, but his family says they are not hopeful about seeing justice served. News 5's Ryan Ang with the story. There was no cover-up. This was the stand of QCPD Director Joselito Esquivel involving the death of Genesis Argoncillo, who was allegedly detained in QCPD Station 4 for alarm and scandal. Esquivel says he based his prior statement on the result of the cursory examination of the doctor who pronounced Argoncillo dead and that there was no external injury. But when the corpse had undergone autopsy, it was revealed that the cause of death was multiple blunt trauma on the head, neck, and upper extremities. I did not cover up anything. We did not change any tune of the investigation. We presented the information as it happens, as it, it came to me. Three inmates have testified against two members of the Sputnik gang, Justin Mercado and Richard Bautista, calling them responsible for Tisoy's murder. According to them, Argoncillo was restless and kept on moving inside the cell, stepping on other resting inmates. The two allegedly asked him to stop, but he did not listen. That is why they beat him up. QCPD officials, however, detailed that there were about 130 inmates locked up inside the cell, which can only accommodate 40 persons when the beating happened. An easy siya, palakad lakad, may time na tumatakbod sa loob ng kulungan. No? At may time nga daw na naapakan yung mga presong, ibang presong na natutulog. Yun ang uh, nag-ignite dun sa dalawa. Argoncillo's sister confirmed that the two inmates even asked money from her. Yan po yung inaabutan ko ng 2020 po eh. Para hindi naman sana siya mabugbog ng ganun pero iba pa lang napuntahan ng ano niya eh, ng buhay niya dahil sa kanila. The station commander, jail guard and three other police were relieved from their post as the investigation goes on. The police are also investigating the discrepancies on the blotter book of the barangay and the spot report of QCPD Station 4 regarding the arrest of Argoncillo. Ayun nga ang sabi na nagpapalood, that is part, will form part of the investigation. Yung ang sinasabing arrest sa alarm and scandal. So there, ang, ang on record, on the police record, he was arrested for alarm and scandal for complaint. So sa record ng balanggay, sinasabi, uh, he was arrested for uh, indecency. Although the culprits were named, the sister of Argoncillo still blames the police for what has happened to his brother. Hindi naman gaano kalaki ang kaso ng kapatid ko eh. Tingnan niyo ang nangyari sa buhay ng kapatid ko na, na walang saysay dahil lang sa kapabayaan niyo. For News 5, Ryan Ang, We Are One News.